So it's something to put on your radar just so you can actually identify if you have a problem with that. And I'm going to show you what to eat and what to do to reverse it. Because if you catch it in time, you can reverse it. But if you don't catch it in time, if you get into this later stage where there's fibrosis, I don't think you can reverse it. So the only solution is a kidney transplant. So what are some things that destroy the kidney? Well, at the top of the list, you have something called ultra processed foods, which is a combination of refined sugars, refined starches, and seed oils, which makes up most junk food. And it's going to create inflammation. And then the body is going to compensate and try to heal and develop scar tissue. We also have more forever chemicals nowadays than we've ever had on the existence of this planet. It's called PFAS chemicals. And so we're bathing in a sea of chemicals. The kidney was never designed to handle that many chemicals. This is why it's super important to have a really good filter for your water and just to avoid these chemicals as much as possible. One of the biggest culprits for damage to the kidney is insulin resistance, which comes from consuming too many ultra processed food calories. I've talked many times about that. And then even the, the side effect from medications, huge. There are certain antibiotics that just destroy the kidney. In fact, a lot of drugs not only destroy the kidney, but the liver as well, because they have side effects and they're super concentrated and they're drugs.